man, if you didn't choose this woman, <laughs> they're going to run you off the farm. Yeah. Uh, it was oh, almost oh, it was so plain yeah. for them to see. Yeah. Um, you know, they were just about to knock you upside your head. <laughs> I need that. <laughs> we all do. Right? Uh, and Whitney, you were so nervous. I even said that you were shaking like a leaf. Yeah, that was a very, very valid statement. I mean, I just, I was so confident in what person I had together. But, you know, this was going to be, you know, one of the best days of my life or a really, really devastating one. And I think that I just tried to stay grounded and just stay realistic about the entire process. And I knew that there was another great girl next to me as well. So it was a very, very nerve-wracking experience. So what is that moment like? You are nervous, and then all of a sudden, he said, I love you, gets down on one knee, says, was, I want to marry you. Oh my gosh. It was just such a really, I mean, that's what I signed up for, you know? And that's what this all comes down to, was that one moment. It was amazing. All right, well, congratulations. Thank you. Much more to get to with you two. We'll talk about the future, where all this goes. We will do that. With Chris and Whitney, congratulations! Woo! Oh! Hello! Yep. Bang of the bullet! On the left? We'll eventually get here. I'll tell you Dang what, you you how long it will last. Dang and of course, tell you when the temperature will take a dive all tonight at 11. Yeah, but like, yeah, you know, but like. Welcome back to the Bachelor after the final rose. I'm here with a very happy, smiley Chris and Whitney. <laughs> Giddy. Yes. Um, one of the great things about the show, and one of the tough things, is to watch it back. I mean, you get to see your fairy tale romance, but was it difficult to watch this show? I actually did not watch. So it was a decision that I made, and Chris supported me in that, and I think it was probably better that way. So you honestly haven't seen anything? Well, I had the opportunity to watch our date specifically, yeah. but the season in general, no. Do you think you'll ever watch it? Mm. Uh, you know, I lived it firsthand, and I feel very confident in a relationship, so I don't know that it's funny. really a necessity for me. Interesting. I, most people do watch the show. What? What precipitated that? What what made you make that decision? You know, it was just kind of a game changing decision for me. Again, like I just felt, you know, living it. Um, you know, I definitely knew what I signed up for, but to be so in love with someone, like I think it's human to, you know, not necessarily want to see him right. with, you know, other women. And again, like that's I knew what I signed up for, but I was confident what we had so many. Interesting. And have you been able to kind of stay in that cone of silence? Has, has anybody told you anything? Have you heard anything? Um, yeah. I mean, I obviously not living in a bubble. And, right. Um, so, and I knew what to anticipate and with social media and everything like that. I mean, right. it, it's out there, but, you know, I feel confident in what we have. So, you know, obviously, what a tough decision that was mm -hmm. and how conflicted he was. Um, does that worry you at all? No, I think that's one of the reasons that I love him so much, and I think that we have that in common, that everything we do, we do 100%. Yeah. And the fact that he gave every relationship that he was in um, the attention that it needed makes me feel even better about what we have. Have you guys talked about it at all? The show? No, just about you know, the ending and him being conflicted. He was at the end. Have you guys discussed it? Yeah, I mean, I think we've kept an open line of communication throughout the entire thing. Yeah. There's no secrets here. That's yeah. a, and that's important. I'm sure it was a good conversation for you to have. Yeah, I mean, we, we talked about a lot of things. And, and it's one thing that's going through something like this. And right. It's very important to communicate, you know, because it's really hard. You know, we went through this incredible two months together, and, and 